You are most welcome to Spice Royal News. Queen Margaret has reunited with all eight of her grandchildren. Before we continue please subscribe and hit the notification button for more updates. Denmark's Queen Margaret reunites with all eight grandchildren for her birthday. Since stripping some of them off their titles the Danish Queen, who celebrated her 83rd birthday on the 16th of this month, was seen on the balcony of Amalie Enberg Palace in Copenhagen on Sunday afternoon with all of her grandkids beside her. This long-awaited unity comes months after she made the announcement that four of the grandchildren would be stripped of their His Royal Highness titles. This took place in September, when Queen Margaret announced the big news to the press. Queen Margaret decided that, as of 1 January 2023, His Royal Highness Prince Joachim's descendants can only use their titles as Counts and Countess of Montpezat, as the titles of Prince and Princess that they have held up until now will be discontinued. Prince Joachim's descendants will thus have to be addressed as excellencies in the future. The Queen's decision is in line with similar adjustments that other royal houses have made in various ways in recent years, per the Danish royal house, at the time, she explained that she made the decision so that they would be able to shape their own lives without being limited by the special considerations and duties that a formal affiliation with the royal house of Denmark involves. The grandchildren affected were Nikolai, Felix, Henrik and Athena. They are now known as His Excellency Count of Montpezat or Her Excellency Countess of Montpezat. Nikolai and Felix are the sons of Joachim and his former wife, Countess Alexandra while he shares Henrik and Athena with his current wife, Princess Marie. Meanwhile, Margaret's other four grandchildren Prince Christian, Princess Isabella, twins Prince Vincent and Princess Josephine, did keep their titles, they are the children of Crown Prince Frederick and Crown Princess Mary, Prince Joachim, whose children were affected expressed. His displeasure with his mother Queen Margaret's decision, Joachim spoke with the press, saying I can say that my children are sad, my kids don't know which leg to stand on, what they should believe, why should their identity be removed, why must they be punished in that way. The crown prince himself didn't say anything in the immediate aftermath, but his wife, Crown Princess Mary, did speak to the press, she said, I can understand that it is a difficult decision to make and a very difficult decision to receive, she continued, change can be difficult and can really hurt. But this does not mean that the decision is not the right one. We will also look at our children's titles when the time comes. Today we do not know what the royal house will look like in Christian's time or when Christian's time begins to approach. This stripping of titles caused a lot of controversies in the royal household. Those affected had grudges against the queen for such a decision. It pushed her second son away from the rest of the family. But thanks to the queen's 83rd birthday, all of them were seen together. It has brought back peace and unity in the royal household. Thanks for watching till the end. Please subscribe and stay tuned for more updates. God bless you.